Graham, a brave effort against the team I think have gone top, um, but in the end, despite all that, not quite enough. Uh, yeah, Simon, that's exactly what happened. Um, I think uh, in football you get two things from the game, you either get reward, which is points, or you get development. I think we've added to a development away from home today, um, from Nottingham Forest. If you remember, we've gone to the third place team, team in the league and now in the second place, we've now gone top. I don't think we're phased. Um, doesn't help when you gift them a first goal at any level. And then it's a second phase from a corner uh, that Kaz does brilliant to stay with Matty Phillips. I know how explosive Matty can be and just lets him get that ball in the box. We'll lose a Jai and, and that's the difference in the game. So it's those, those little errors that you've been trying to um, get rid of over the course of the season. Yeah, but we've limited mm, them. True. That's 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 the pleasing aspect. Mm. That becomes it's becoming less and less. And uh, obviously we're missing what happened today, uh, who's grew I, th I feel in the last two or three weeks. Um, and then you got the other end of the pitch where uh, Pelly Ruddick just needs to side foot a, a ball first time, and I'm sure it have been one one. And um, penalty possibly when he went down. Uh, from where I was, I felt like it was a penalty because Pelly just stays. He stays on his feet. He loves a one v one duel. He just I've never seen him dive in my life. Um, I felt like it was a penalty, and then Callum had a great chance. Maybe it was too quickly after he came on. And you've got to really, you've got to take them, them chances at a club like this, just to turn the crowd, just to get a bit nervy in the ground, and. Again, that was one aspect defensively, key area, and on the offensive side, that was a, they were key areas in the game. Um, was there an element of, sort of having put so much effort in on Tuesday that it caught up with one or two here and there? Uh, no, I don't think so. Sai, I don't think so, no. I was, uh, I was pleased with us off the ball. I think on the ball at times we could have been a little bit more confident, uh, have a little bit more conviction. Sometimes that's down to personnel. Um, but uh, you know, overall, you don't want to. I'm not happy with a two-nil defeat. Um, but we have to, we have to measure the context of the game, and that's all we're trying to do. And you've been able to give uh, Cameron Carter Vickers uh, sort of 20 minutes at the end there. Well, I thought it was important because because mm. uh, Cam's going to be important for us going forward. Um, and I liked I liked the look of his performance. It was very assured. He'd ha he'd have a touch. He's a defender. Um, and I think uh, it'll help us a lot. Obviously, I mean, home games are going to be so important, but you, you, if you could just nick one or two here and there away from home. Well, you wouldn't pick West Brom or Nottingham no. Forest to do no. it, so I know. I just, I'm, I'm, I'm just measuring, um, I'm measuring improvement. Like I said after the Forest game, uh, I was pleased with certain aspects. What followed after that performance was a win. I was pl pleased with certain aspects today. I wasn't pleased with the result. Um, but you have to look beyond that result sometimes. Were we competitive? Yeah. Were we overawed? No. Did we believe that we could get some it? Mm, maybe I need another little bit more from them at a place like West Brom. But I can assure you from where we've been, if you think about performances in Bristol City and, and other clubs, we, we had a lot more belief and a lot more resilience in the group. And uh, I'm sure it'll come. Thank you. Well, it's a long ball from them. James Bree tries to help it over uh, the wide man's head in the uh, tunny it must be. Loses it and crossing the box and it's an own goal, Mike, and you're on the back foot. All we spoke about was the first half an hour of the game, managing it. So we give them that. The result says 2-0, but we give them that start, which is a psychologically it's a it's an uphill climb from that point on. So you don't want to do that at any level in any game. And then you look like I mean there was a little side, wasn't it? But you you, you were did threaten in the rest of that first half. Didn't yeah, a little bit. I thought maybe the first 15 minutes of the second half more, um, but you know them them key moments that come your way. Pell's just got a side footed. If it's on target, he'll score just with the momentum of the ball cut back from Kaz, a step over from Harry, and then a penalty. And I expected Callum to wrap that ball into the into the top right hand corner as he came onto it. You just, uh, you know, they're really important moments 
in, in the game in terms of belief and uh, we, we didn't manage to convert. And the timing of that second goal as well, wasn't it? as you mentioned, you just kind of getting back into the game on the front foot and that kind of, kind of kills it off, doesn't it really? Yeah, I mean, second phase at any level of a set play is very, very difficult to deal with, very difficult. Um, and Kaz has done everything to slow the cross down, so we should be able to be marked in the box. That's my disappointment. He gets half a yard on one of our players, who it was his job to mark him from the first phase. And next thing you know, Matty can, Matty can cross a ball as good as anybody. And the next thing you know, you're 2 0 down, and then it is a, an uphill climb. It's an impressive performance from the goalkeeper as well. I mean, two excellent saves, and he, he looks like he's growing into his, uh, his there right now, doesn't he? Yeah, absolutely. Um, I felt uh, assured with him. I said that to him after the Derby game. Um, and uh, that just shows you everybody, all the, the older coaches that I've worked under through the years when I was a player said you need six months to settle at any level, no matter who you are. And <coughs> it took him six months and he looks like he's confident, he looks like he knows the league. He's always had that, that's his ability, them reactions. It's the other moments, he's kicking better, he's controlling moments better in the game. He, he's a quick goalkeeper so you see him coming out and making contact on balls sometimes where other keepers would backpedal and leave it. So I think it was another improvement, uh, Mike, uh, from, from Simon today.